We'll guide you through how to add a timer or a counter in CapCut. If you find this useful, then consider subscribing and liking the video. First of all, you need to go and get a timer or a counter or stopwatch or whatever to go and add. To do that, you can open up your web browser, come to a site called Pixabay or elsewhere, and you can go and search for that. I'll just go for this one here. Once you've clicked on it, click on download at the top, choose the quality, and then you can click on download. Press download and it should start. On an iPhone, we need to save it to our camera roll. To do that, come over to the left of the URL bar where the blue download icon is, then click on downloads. Click on what we just downloaded and click on the share button in the bottom left and we can click on save video. That will save it to our camera roll. Now you can return to CapCut and then what you need to do is go to the bottom, make sure nothing is selected and click on overlay and then add overlay. We can then go and select it and click on add in the bottom right. Then what we can do is scroll along to the end and choose where you want it to end. For me, that's here. Make sure it's selected and click on split. Select the bit you want to delete and then click on delete. Then select the layer again. And what you want to do is scroll along at the bottom till you see the option transform. Then click on resize. Now what you want to do is crop out the unnecessary sort of black background or whatever the background is. And you can then click on the tick in the top right. You can then pinch it and reposition it to where you want it. And what I like to do is just go and lower the opacity. I press the back button in the bottom left and scroll along until I see opacity just here. And we can then go and decrease it just like so.